on. This is going to be about Draymond Green and his podcast and social media, and he says the new media. He just got his fourth ring. He woke his behind up after he got benched by Steve Kerr. Was it uh, game four? Yeah, because he was playing like poo-poo the first two, three games in the finals. He was Game two, he stole it. He pulled a rhyme in that tantic, got under <clears throat> the Celtics' skin, but he actually balled the last couple of games. He saved face, but he was playing like dog a lot of it. But anyway, he got his ring, and he's an integral part of, of, of with Steph Curry and Klay Thompson's the three. That's one. Four rings in eight years, and he's had his part. For better or for worse, it depends on where you come down with him. You know, he's he's um, he's a comedian of different people, you know, but not the strong suits of them all at their best. This new media thing, um, it's comical. You know, cats have always had words with media and back and forth and stuff. Draymond doesn't want to be called out when he plays like booty. And he played like booty. <laughs> he was booty. <clears throat> A lot of this series, a lot of antics, you know, a lot of things. Now, I'm not saying it don't work to get underneath somebody's skin, but don't care. And listen, I saw Dennis Rodman. Rodman beat you psychologically. Any y'all rebound, I'll hustle you. Draymond looked flat a couple games out there. Just like his butt shouldn't even been out there. You know, the refs were out hustling him. But anyway, um, <clears throat> point is, they want to control the narrative. Well, you can f- clap back on Twitter and Instagram, et cetera, et cetera. Problem you run into, someone's going to hold your feet to the fire about when you're stinking it up. Any cats don't want to be told nothing because this is a pampered era. And I already said that. All these artists, you know, I've seen it the last 30 years in hip-hop. Remember in the Source Awards when cats couldn't get five mics or even four mics? Remember when Benzino actually had a credible gig? Remember? Have to bring him up now because things are a lot blue, kind of rusty, crusty now. But anyway, they wanted to beat you up if you didn't give them. And that's what you're dealing with. A culture that feels entitled but doesn't want to be called out to step your game up. See, and that's the thing. And there are a few who step their game up, you know. But Draymond supports <clears throat> that, you know, don't say nothing, you know, that kind of mindset. And it's. It's a one-sided affair, so if you're not having a debate, then you're just talking to yourself. But then again, you get a feeling that's what a lot of them want. And Draymond's one of them. He'd rather hear himself talk and think than to be told that, hey, you're missing your assignments. You're timid to shoot sometimes. Your drives are off. Your passes is behind. And you're getting outworked and outplayed. You know, He stepped up the last two games. And fortunately for him, who he played with. Because Steph is one of the greatest players ever. That's not even a question anymore. And Clay Thompson is one of the most underrated and appreciate great talents too. But you got to hold your end up. So anyway, this media thing is a trip. But anyway, give me your thoughts and takes about uh, Draymond Green trying to push the new media agenda, which is basically talking to himself, which a lot of us do. you know. And we get feedback, and I welcome it. Because I don't have no problem with <clears throat> feedback. Good or bad or indifferent. But I'm not going to say, you know, you don't want to boast all of them and say that you don't do nothing right or wrong. You don't want to make it like 101 by the other. You got to have balance. Please hit like, subscribe, welcome thoughts and comments. And I do respond. Thank you. Wash your hands. Keep your mind clear. Watch out for another. And now, Draymond going to keep talking because now he got rings. And, you know, they're, they're, that's what they lie on him. They want him. You can see what's going down. I'm out.